and uh and is rocky where's rock rocky no it's not rocky <laughs> hey so hey everybody if you're watching today this morning happy memorial day weekend right and uh, to all of those all those we have lost in deep memory to all of those of service to our country um and including me i was in the air force for four years you know uh, but happy memorial day everybody today my friends call me the tortoise guy, and um, we are going to have a very short and sweet live stream today. Why? Well, because we have been busy raising. Ready for this? So we had a pop-up yard sale yesterday. Last weekend, if you have not been following, oh my God, okay? Kaya, the drara includes my dog, Joanna, the doggy. Hi, 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 how are you? Hi. Hey, so um, thanks for watching, everybody. And uh, we're going to have a short and sweet um, uh, live stream today. We live stream every Sunday. Now, check this out. So what's happened is, and um, because it is Memorial Day weekend, a holiday, it's just me today holding the camera. Um, okay. Hi, guys. Mary. Hi, Marie. Hi. Great to see you. Great to be here. So everybody, forgive me. Hey, if my mic goes out, let me know. Okay. It's on right now. I can see that. Morning, all. Tracy. Hey. All the regulars. Look who says hi. Come here. Who's saying hi right now? Hi. That's right. Who's saying hi? That's saying what? Hey, saying happy Labor Day. Right, so let's see here. All right. Somebody just said congrats on... We have almost 10,000 subscribers, everybody, right? Let's say your channel, amazing. Oh, my God, Tara Wanti. Really? Oh, that's music to my ears. That makes me want to cry, you know? All right? Rocky, too, everybody. Okay, hold up. So Kevin is doing the camera work today because it's just me, because it is Memorial Day weekend. There's Craig Ray Rocky. Tracy Wells, we'll go see if we can dig out. Um, if we can, Let's see here. Hi, Rocky. Aha, uh -huh. right? We're going to see if we can dig out. Um, punk and everybody, okay? But it is overcast, everybody, extremely overcast and cool. So what does that mean? Tortoises are cold-blooded creatures, right? So they're like, we don't want to come out. Now, I want to show you something amazing. We, okay, you guys know or don't know, guys and gals, we had a huge, massive fundraiser because we need to raise money for tortoise land, right? We are a nonprofit. Sweet Piper inside. She is inside, Tracy. Yeah. You know, maybe she'll come out. She likes to come out. I'm a shocked that Rocky's out. Okay. Oh, and I can see Lumpy's out over there. Okay. So some of them are starting to come out. Love your necklace. Ah, thanks. Thank you. I appreciate it. Me too. You know, I got this in Hawaii. So whether you're a sea turtle, a turtle or a tortoise, bam, we love you. You've been around 200 million years. You are survivors. Okay. In order for tortoise land to survive, we have... Had a massive fun run. Come on, Ricky. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm going to show you all. Come here. Come here. Come here. Okay. First off, look at this mural work, everybody. This is brand new. This is by, and that's going away. We just had it for our yard sale as, as all those tables. But look at this incredible. This is Henry Goods, everybody. The most amazing muralist, okay, that I found at a gas station. He had a mural at a gas station not far from here, uh, a year and three months ago when we were going to open Tortoise Land officially, I pulled up with Rocky and Piper and baby Sheldon, okay, on our way back from the hospital, and um, I saw this incredible mural work. It was Marine Life, and Henry had his name on the bottom, and I'm like, oh my God, you know, and I called him. I'm like, hey, I got this nonprofit, and uh, can you come over? And he said, okay. And and uh, and the rest is history. So this is his newest creation, everybody. Okay. All right. Listen, we're gonna be short and sweet. I keep saying it. Okay. I want to show you the remnants. Hey, Rock. What is left out here? This is what is left of our yard sale. Okay. Which is absolutely nothing compared to what we had. Compared to what we had. All right. So here's some major milestones, everybody, because of. Your support because of the community support. Hold on. Hold on here. Okay. Okay. We had the most tremendous uh, loving outpouring of support from our community. So many donations that we had extended the yard sale till yesterday. The mural is amazing, is it not? Okay. And here's the cool part. Look. So this is now the foyer entrance into Tortoise Land. Okay. So it starts with this gorgeous sea turtle. And, you know, we have a playlist called Maui. 
where I got to swim with sea turtles and learn from the experts. There are experts there that, that uh, care for the sea turtles. So if you haven't seen it, check out the playlist called Maui. Hey, we're going to let uh, Nuts the Squirrel out in a couple minutes too. So you can't miss that. So look at this, everybody. So you come in here like this. This is the new, the new foyer. We start here with the sea turtle and the marine life. Where is he? Okay. Then the marine life turns to, bam, tortoise land. Okay. Tortoise land is the name of our nonprofit 501c3. That is exactly the lettering that Henry created. And that is on our letterhead. When? When Tawante. When what, Tawante? I don't know what you're saying. When, oh, when what? Uh, let me know what you're talking about, okay? So forgive my camera work because it's just me. All right, so look at this, everybody. So you push through the gates of Tortoise Land. Bam. And you come into Tortoise Land, okay? Now, Tortoise Land's a bit of a wreck of a mess. You know, we had a pop-up yard sale yesterday. We hit. We are hitting major milestones, everybody. Major milestones. What's the major milestone? The first one, our goal is to raise ten thousand dollars for Tortoise Land. Don't worry, I'm gonna pitch. I'm not gonna pitch for money today. Okay. Oh, I am gonna pitch for a little, a big girl. I'm gonna pitch for a big girl. So this is. Let's see. I think you achieve forty k in two to three days. What? I don't know. Somebody out there is telling me that we might get 40,000 subscribers. I don't know. I don't know. That's crazy. But guess what? We have almost 10,000 subscribers. Guess what? Guess what, beautiful digger? Guess what, honey? She is an African cicada, born right here in tortoise land. She has my heart and soul because why? She is so friendly, so gentle, just like her dad, Max, the gentle giant of tortoise land we lost almost two years ago. And that's a whole playlist you have to check out called Max the Gentle Giant. Okay? So uh, beautiful and uplifting and also sad, but mostly beautiful and uplifting. My friend Kay Allen, if you're listening, my, my, my friends and family did so much. So look at the baby girl. Hi, honey. Okay? So this is beautiful Digger. Why Digger? Because she loves digging. Okay. So listen, major milestones of the $10,000 we need to raise to help... To help fund Tortoise Land, we raised, are you ready for this? 5500 5500 on our yard sales, okay? 5500 on our yard sale, okay? Okay, we had it last weekend, and uh, um, we had it last weekend, and then we decided to do a pop-up yesterday. Check out the videos. It's the video right now if you go to, to, to the, look at the show, okay? I'm going to post another one this afternoon where we had... Um, we had a bunch of the tortoises out. Now look at here, everybody. Nuts the squirrel. Okay. So say hi. What is the story of nuts? I have another video. Yesterday I shot where nuts for the first time. So I release her every morning. She can do what she wants to do. She's great friends with Rocky and Piper. So she gets to go wherever she wants to go. And for the first time, hey, hi, Taran. Hey. Hi. Nice to have you on here. Now watch this. Okay. How are you, man? I am great. How are you? Happy uh, Memorial Day weekend, everybody. Okay. And uh, hey, we got the babies over there. So I got to go over there and see them. I want to do something cool. Okay. We're going to release this little girl. Ready? Come on. Come on, little girl. Oh, okay. Hold on, everybody. Hold on, everybody. Look at this. Look at this. Okay. She was badly injured. Come on. She was badly injured five weeks ago. Come on up. Oh, here she is. Look. Oh, she's going to get a peanut. Look at this. Okay. Look at Okay, she was badly injured. Wait, come on, come on, come on. Oh no, see, she's shy. Right? She's shy when it comes to, yeah, look at this, watch this, okay? Right here, look, 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 right here, right there. Wanna come? Come on up, come on, come on, come on up. Okay, look, she's not that shy, everybody. Oh, she's a jumper. Yeah, look at her, okay? She's a jumper. Hi, Rocky. Look, she likes to chew, watch. <laughs> She's quite the chewer, everybody, right? She has to, right? She's so happy. She is happy, and I'm a happy dad. Look at you. I know. Come here. Come here. Right here. Watch this. Watch this. Oh, look at you, baby girl. Look at you, right? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Who would have ever thought, right? Come here, Rocky. Come here. Okay. Come on out back. Okay. So listen, everybody. Short and sweet. We have almost 10,000 subscribers. OMG. Now, you know who's thrilled about that? Lumpy, come on, Rock. Come on, honey. Baby girl, that's my baby girl. That's right. Come on. 
Rocky, come on up here, honey. Come on. Ready? Come on. Up, up. There you go. I know. Okay. Look at this mural work, everybody. This is all by Henry. Okay. Henry Goods. Okay. He's amazing. All right. He has really transformed this place into truly a magical tortoise land. Right, Rocky? Yeah. Lumpy is like, oh my God, we got 10,000 subscribers. We're actually only like maybe 150 or so subscribers away from 10,000. What a milestone. We're looking to raise $10,000. And we have 5,500 of that. And we still have the silent auction where all of you can participate. Okay, we got some amazing, cool stuff. Uh, oh my God, all of us love Tortoise Land. Miguel, is this Miguel or Miguel and Dash? Yes, right. Right. Very nice work, Henry. That's right. Okay. Yep. Stop. Yes. Hey. hey. Uh -huh. Right. Wow. What's up? He's saying hi, everybody. He's saying, he's saying, he's saying, look at he's such a jerk, right? So Lumpy is not buying it. Huh? But listen, everybody, I think we just passed 10,000 subscribers, possibly. Okay, look who's over there. She's busy chewing, okay? Okay, so where are all the tortoises? Okay, let's go take a look, all right? Like I said, short and sweet today. It's just me here. Everybody's enjoying their, oh, 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 hey, hey, what are you doing? Okay, there's uh, that sniper the bird, okay? Sniper the bird. So look at everybody. These guys are nesting, okay? So look at, I got the babies out, but only for a minute because I wanted to show you all. Let's see. What does it say? Rocky is a hot mess. <laughs> Rocky's always been a hot mess. He's, he, he, he takes after his dad. That's right, right? Hey, Kay Allen, if you're watching, Kay and Tim Bradley and Kim, uh, among my best friends. I'm not very emotional because... Uh, I always am emotional, but I'm especially emotional because we have crossed the threshold of 10,000 subscribers. About two and a half years ago in COVID, we started this YouTube channel. Kevin not knowing a dang thing about YouTube. I know a lot about videos. I've been shooting them my whole life. Just ask my friends. I annoy them. Just ask my dad who says every time I go home to Boston, he's like, if you put that camera in my face one more time, pow. So I've been always doing that. I went to film school at UCLA, work as an editor for TV. I love, I love shooting stuff. Now, speaking of shooting stuff, so 10,000 subscribers. Our goal is $10,000. We've raised 5,500. How can you help? Patreon.com, GoFundMe, PayPal, and now Venmo. All those, just do a search for tortoise land or tortoise guy. Every dollar is tax deductible. If we got 1,000 people that gave us one buck each for Patreon.com, that's that would be a thousand dollars a month. It's only a three month commitment and you become a member and you get videos. No one else gets, you get a lot of cool stuff. But anyways, whether you do that or not, okay, check this out. Here's the babies. Got some major news. Digger and dumpster. They're not here. Why? They are on a huge piece of land in Las Vegas, baby, Vegas, baby. What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. Well, guess what? A woman hit me up who Loves, loves, loves tortoises and um, wanted Compton and Dumpster as a pair, which is music to my ears. Why? Because they came as a pair as little babies, right? And look these up. Speaking of little babies, okay? So here's the deal, okay? Look at the biggest of all of Shy Girl's kids. Can you, can you, can you see it? We're going to see. The biggest one right here is Charcoal, everybody. Mm, that's right. My partner named this one, right? Because he's the dark, so dark, huh? Charcoal, beautiful. Look at the size of these guys. These are African sulcatas, third largest species in the world. We have successfully rehomed two of the remaining 29, or, okay? Uh, um, we, so because rehoming is a big part of what we do, right? So if you live in the Southern California or you want to travel here, and, and what's important is that we teach you how to care for them. We do not ship tortoises. We are not an active breeder, okay? Okay, excuse me. We don't do that, okay? But um, in, or, in order to um, acquire one, 
you got to come here. We have to show you what we do here. There's a lot of videos we do, how to care. And it was a, a, one right out right now that's so good um, by Eternity and Robert. We're getting really cool volunteers now, right, pal? Really cool volunteers that come and stay and help. We had Daniel and his girlfriend named D. Yesterday, we're going to do a collaboration. D and I, she does natural women's hair weaves and stuff. I could use one. She said she'd make one for me. Um, okay. And um, so we rehome tortoises, okay? Digger, no, Dumpster and Compton are now on a beautiful, huge piece of land. You could fit 10 uh, tortoise lands on that piece of land. So we try to find and, and are able to find the best homes. You don't have to have 10 acres of land. You don't have to have one-tenth of an acre of land, okay? We'll show you how to do it. How do you reach me? The tortoiseguykevin at gmail.com. Right, Charcoal? Okay. Really proud of these guys. Take a look at our two redfoots, too. OMG, everybody. Look at This is Little Red, who's go doing so good now. He's about five weeks old. Look at the growth, okay? We are very proud of how we care for our tortoises. These are the first two ever born here in tortoise land from Big Mama, okay? How about that? So there's there's Little Red, and here's Tiny Little Red. Not really tiny, huh? Both are thriving. Both are succeeding. Both are doing so well. Oh, look who's coming. I hear a squirrel coming. Okay, so everybody, what do they want to say? Uh, tortoise Land is thriving, and we're cutting it short today. Why? Because we're tired. We did, we did um, the yard sale all last weekend, plus it took two weeks of prep to get all that incredible stuff from so many incredible neighbors and friends i am moved to tears beyond my wildest dreams that we would that we would raise fifty five hundred dollars everybody okay plus a silent auction coming soon okay hey so one little tidbit if you if you're looking for tips okay i am a big proponent of plastic containers okay not plastic per se because it's ruining the ocean. So we should have biodegradable plastics. And the fact we don't is, is really criminal, okay? However, so these containers are what I recommend, okay? People have tortoises and that in glass tanks. I'm not an expert and I'm not no, no here to put you down. I'm just going to say uh, I don't think they're good, okay? I can say that. That's my opinion. I don't think they're good. Why? Because, because they hold in the heat. They don't circulate well, okay? They don't do that. So these containers are great. First of all, go spend 10 bucks is all. Get a nice big container. This is what I have for their nursery. And they are getting so big, everybody, that they're too big for this. Oh, here's Dent, everybody, too. Oh, hi, Dent. Look at it. Eating a little carrot, okay? So this is Dent. You remember Dent? Just kind of mangled up. Well, Dent is doing so good. These, they're all doing good, okay? So look at containers. 10 bucks at Lowe's, 10 bucks at Lowe's, okay? I just order them online and go pick them up at my local Lowe's, okay? We got one here. Oh, look who's hanging out. Look who's hanging out, okay? Who's over there? Look at This is what these guys do, box turtles. They hide. They are such good hiders. Tortoises are amazing, amazing hiders. And the big guys, Martha and Zippa, have been mating like crazy. Check out the videos I put out. There's, been, there's a lot of... Go to the playlist and go to check out more than the shorts. The shorts is nice and everybody and they're fun and they're good. And I try to learn things. Mostly they're fun, but you want to learn stuff. You want to hear the music of the show. You want to see the drone shots, all that stuff that makes us really cool and exceptional is the playlist and the longer form videos. Okay. I haven't edited one lately to turtle Tom. If you're watching, this is next. We did a collab with two turtle Tom, who's in Ohio, who came here and visited. He specializes in hinge tortoises, okay? So these guys, they need homes now. They're four months old. They are ready. They are ready, except, of course, the reds, because they're not going nowhere, right? We have never had any. So, like I said, we are not active breeders, okay? If tortoises lay eggs, oh, I'm going to show you one last thing. Eggs, okay? Now, here's an important thing, okay? See this thing? Okay, these guys are little, right? These guys are little. You saw you saw the two birds up here, right? Luckily, those two birds, sniper and girlfriend, they don't harm the birds. They don't harm the tortoises. What they do is they swoop in and they grab the food. Smart little guys, right? And girls. All right. So watch this. I do not leave them unattended. If you have babies out, you okay? Don't not leave them. 
without protection. What do we got here? Chicken wire, right? Right here. Beautiful chicken wire. Beautiful chicken wire. Watch. Watch. It's going to happen. Okay. Hold on, everybody. Okay. Watch. Boom. And boom. Okay. And boom. See that? So now what happens? Now these guys are protected. They still have the sunlight they can get. Okay. And, uh, and yet there's no birds going to get them. Plus you want to make sure you put caves and stuff to protect them from the sun and to give them, to not stress them out, right? Not stress them out. Okay. I don't think anybody's out over here and I'm not going to pull anybody out. Look at this beautiful mural work, huh? Hey, if you haven't subscribed, please do. Please tell your friends to. We just crossed the 10,000 mark. Okay. Oh, look who's out. Look who's coming down. Hey, dude, what's up? Hey, that is one of our resident desert tortoises, everybody. Desert tortoises are an endangered species, so we do not rehome those, okay? That's not, it's against the law, okay? We don't do that, okay? But we have several, and we have several here, though. Look at this, okay? Come say hi. Here's our ingenious, ingenious, look, we got our beautiful... A beautiful. Yeah, I just fed them some fresh vegetables down there. Oh, look who's down there. There's a tortoise down there. We have lots of places for these tortoises. People don't know. We're a very small facility because we're in the heart of Los Angeles. We don't have a half acre, an acre, five acres of land. We don't have the big piece of land that Michelle has in Vegas where Dumpster and Compton are. But what we have is very clever. Okay, We have tortoise land mountain. We have many spots for the tortoises to hibernate, to dig, to lay eggs. We have three bridges here, okay? And this is the top one. Hey, what's going on, huh? What's going on? This is Boss. Boss is a girl, and she is bossy. She's a lot like punk, Tracy. So speaking of punk, let's see if I can find him, okay? Let's see. All right, let's see. Down there, we got our elongated, we got leopards, we got Indian star. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Hi, honey. Okay, we got Herman. We got the little guy. We got over here. This is our little beautiful bean, our dwarf African piccata. And let's see here. Who do I see? Uh, I'm looking for punk. Okay, let's see. Bam, over here. No. Let's see you over here. See, Tracy Wells, punk. Punk has. A twin. No, not real. Oh, yeah, he does have a twin. This is the twin. But it, it, she's a girl. And she's a desert tortoise, okay? She has no fear. Hey, tortoises are off the hook. Awesome, everybody. Well, how did I get into tortoises? Well, because as a little kid, I fell in love with them. I fell in love with the fact that they're 200 million years old. I fell in love with the fact that they can live up to a year without food, several months without water. I fell in love with the fact that they're smart and they're friendly. And they figure things out. They're incredible climbers. And they're going extinct, everybody. So our job is to educate people. We get a lot of young kids involved because they're going to change the world. Global warming is a massive crisis because all reptile eggs, the temperature of the ambient outside temperature determines the sex of the, of the reptile. And they're all being born female. Don't take my word for it, okay? Don't take my word for it. Go and Google it. Sea turtles, okay? All female, female virtually, okay? Same with all these guys. So if we don't fix it, if we don't think global warming is real, we're wrong, okay? That's right, okay? Bam, right there. What are you going to do, pal? So how about this? There's six desert tortoises, and, uh, and, the, and the person that had them prior to me takes two boards and smacks them together after he puts out their food, okay? And they know then that it's dinner time. They're sniping the birds, see down there? Looking for, so whenever I feel, I feed this, we have box turtles and that, I feed the millworms, certain tortoises like worms. So when I do that, sniper over there is watching. Look at, he's in there now, digging up the millworms and stuff. So let's see if I can find punk. One last thing, then we're gonna say goodbye for today. Let's see, oh hi, look who's here. Okay, we got some box turtles. We got, this is Juvie, everybody. You know, that's Marmalade, the red foot. This is Blackie, huh? We'll pick Blackie up. Come on, hold on, okay? We'll pick Blackie up right here. Come on, Blackie. This is Blackie, a Greek tortoise. We'll put her down there, over there. Blackie laid three eggs. She laid three eggs on, um, on Earth Day week, which is phenomenal. Usually when she lays eggs, about every three, four years, they hatch. 
Maybe Gargantuan, Jimmy the Greek, Jamie the Greek. Okay, we lost. Jimmy the Greek was stolen by a volunteer that um, turned bad, you know, and that was crushing. That was a crushing loss, okay? And we lost Jamie the Greek to hypothermia over the winter. Never lost a tortoise ever, but it was so cold. And, and she crawled off, he crawled off the heat pad and I never happened ever in the history of tortoise land. So when it gets cold again, you know, we are prepared now and learn and to, to learn to fix that. So no matter what, I bring them in the house when it gets real cold. Okay. All right. Who's back here? This is, uh, this is our desert tortoise anyway. And this is Pepe. This is Pepe. I don't know where punk is Tracy. So no punk today. Look at this is Pepe. Pepe is a Greek tortoise. Pepe, we, this is the only husband and wife pair right here. Congratulations, right? They have stayed married the whole time they've been here at Tortoise Land, okay? So let's see. I'm going to move you over a little bit, pal, right there, okay? All right. So guess what, everybody? We're going to wrap it up, okay? We'll be back next uh, Sunday. We got new videos coming out, okay? Um, I documented, hold on, okay? I documented, of course. The, the Michelle who took in Dumpster and Compton and her son off the hook. Not only that, they've been sending videos um, um, daily almost of, of them on their huge piece of land. I'm jealous. Punk gets around. No worries. Thanks, Tracy. I appreciate you. Okay. All right, everybody. So guess what? From all the tortoises at Tortoise Land and from me and Rocky and Piper and Lumpy. Okay. And Lumpy. Bam. Uh, we say thank you. Thanks for your love. Thanks for your support. And thanks for hanging in here. Thanks for all your comments. I have not got to the, all the comments and emails. To the tourist guy, Kevin. At, Punk does get around. <laughs> right? So a lot of people have emailed. And, uh, and uh, oh, hey, Rocky. Come here. What's up? Come on over here. Come on. Let's go say. Okay. So we're going to say hey for now. We're going to say hey. If you haven't checked out the videos this week, check out the video. I'll be dropping one right after this. After, in about an hour of the yard sale with um, with uh, a lot of the tortoises were out front and people were amazed. We had over 200 people come through tortoise land uh, and, and they love what we do. I'm proud of what we do. And uh, the pterodactyl is proud of what we do. Max is, is proud. So, hey, everybody, you have a beautiful rest of your Memorial Day weekend from the tortoises of tortoise land. Thanks for your love and support, everybody. We're going to say goodbye. Okay. That's it.